Right, the big political story from Bengal and Mamta Banerjee is filing her nomination today for from the Bhabani Apur seat for the 30th of September by poll so she can get elected to the state assembly and continue as the chief minister. However, the BJP is also fielding a candidate to find out more. Let's go across to Moni Deepa. Moni, tell us about this contest that we're going to see at, in this by poll. Well, looks like it's going to be as hard fought as the elections uh, back in April, May. Uh, Mamta Banerjee uh, contesting from Bhavanipur, her old seat of two elections. Uh, both times she had won and the Trinamool confident that she will pull off a uh, hat-trick. But the BJP has just announced its candidate. Uh, that's a lawyer, Priyanka Chibrewal. And she has been a long-time worker of the BJP, most recently in the headlines because she is one of the lawyers and petitioners in the post-poll violence case and has aggressively uh, pursued the matter in court and was part of, you know, pressing for CBI probe into post-poll violence. So Priyanka Chibrawal is BJP's choice of candidate and uh, Mamta Banerjee on the other side. Congress has said no fielding of candidate against Mamta Banerjee, keeping in mind perhaps the 2024 general elections uh, when uh, Mamta Banerjee wants to have an opposition unity and has started working on it, having met Sonia Gandhi in Delhi on the 28th of July. The left has fielded a candidate and it's a 31-year-old Kolkata lawyer who has not fought an election before so far we know. It will be a triangular contest. We don't know if there will be independence, of course, as yet. But uh, Bhavanipur will be hard fought. No question, Mamta Banerjee is, uh, you know, the top runner. No question about that. Not only has she won the elections twice from the seat, she, uh, uh, she nominated a very senior Trinamool leader to fight the elections at Bhavanipur this time, Shobhandev Chattopadhyay. And he won by a margin of over 25,000 votes. Mamta Banerjee, of course, went and fought at Nandigram, where she lost uh, to her arch-rival, Shubhendra Adhikari. Now, Trinamool has gone to court, challenging that particular result. But in the meantime, what became crucial is that Mamta Banerjee be elected to assembly before the 4th of November, which is six months from her being sworn in chief minister. It is necessary for her to be elected MLA to the assembly and that is why this particular election. However, what is interesting is even this bipol and the announcement of the bipol in Bhavanipur has turned controversial with the BJP and the left raising questions about why is it that bipoles are only being held in Bhavanipur when four other seats are due bipoles in Bengal. In fact, 31, I believe, in all across the country. So this is a question that has been coming up. Two matters, two PILs have been filed in court. They'll be coming up on Monday. Mamta Banerjee expected any minute to come and file her nomination right now here at Survey Building. Apparently, keeping with the spirit, the festival spirit, she has chosen Ganesh Chaturthi to file her nomination because it is an auspicious day. Back to you. All right, uh, Monidipa, thanks so much for joining us uh, with all those developments uh, there in Bengal.